Some Carroll High School students are taking matters into their own hands after the school canceled their spring play. They say this happened because the show has LGBTQ plus characters. Fox 55's Brianna Bias attended their rehearsal tonight and now tells us how they've gotten this grassroots production off the ground. Bookie Kim is a really gentle fun Three weeks to showtime. Just like take it down a little bit. Carroll High School freshman Josiah Montez is finally rehearsing his role as the sheriff of Nottingham. Give me a little sample. Um, hello, love. Well, give me your taxes. The play is called Marion or the True Tale of Robin Hood, and the show almost didn't go on. Senior Caitlin Gully says the school's principal initially gave it the green light until some parents found out it has LGBTQ characters. That was one day. And then the next day it was like, okay, we're not doing this anymore. She says she sat down with the principal and he explained that they were not necessarily concerned with students being uncomfortable, but that adults in the community might be uncomfortable, bringing them to protest here outside the school, which would be a safety risk. Last year, um, the whole mask mandates, uh, there was a lot of adults who were very upset about that, and it just was, it wasn't safe. I reached out to Northwest Allen County Schools for their perspective, but have not heard back. Gully says she and other students took matters into their own hands. This is Carol. They told their story on social media and within a day and a half raised over $73,000, some of which came from the Broadway cast of Sweeney Todd. So we're sending on some messages of love and support and some financial support to make sure that you have a great show. We love you. We support you. Thank you for fighting the good fight. Honestly, having so much support from so many people trying to tear it down, it's just a big old eat that. The cast says they're going to keep doing their thing no matter what anyone else says. I have to follow my mom. Do what's best for me. We're not the underdogs in this situation. Like, we're actually coming out on top and we're going to do this. In Fort Wayne, I'm Brianna Bias, Fox 55 News. And that show will take place at the Follinger Theater on May 20th at 7 p.m. You can purchase tickets through the link in this story on our website, WFFT.com.